Hello again. This is Tim from OracleBase.com. Today we're going to be talking about generating random data using the DBMS random package. The first thing we need to do is decide if we want to seed the random number generator. In this block of code, we set the seed to a value of zero and then loop through five times calling the value function. We then reset the seed and loop again. We can see from the output that we get the same five numbers generated each time. This can be quite useful in testing where we want to do repeated runs but make sure those runs are comparable. In this example we use a timestamp to create a unique string and then use that in the call to the seed procedure. In this way each run gets a unique seed. The output shows we've got unique values in each run. We didn't really need to call the seed procedure a second time. Without it, we would have just got more random numbers anyway. The value function works in two ways. Without any parameters, it returns a fraction. It can also accept high and low values and produce a random number between that range. If you want a range of integers, remember to trunk the return value and add one to the upper boundary. The string function returns a random string of the specified length. The first parameter indicates the format of the string. U means uppercase, L means lowercase, A means mixed alpha, X means alphanumeric in uppercase, and P means any printable character. Combining the string and value functions allows us to produce random length strings. The normal function returns random numbers in a normal distribution. We can generate random dates by adding or subtracting random numbers from dates. If we do the appropriate division, we can also alter hours, minutes or seconds. To pull this all together, let's create a table to hold a variety of number, string and date columns. Using the functions we've described previously, we can easily populate it with a variety of number, string and date values. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check out the links in the description box and subscribe to the channel and like the video if you liked it.